Hey everyone, Tio here. It has been a while since I've uploaded any videos, so today I want to talk about my holiday and sketching trip in Seoul, South Korea, and also at the Gyeongju Sketch Festa, which happened on the 2nd to 4th of June 2023. This market is Gwangjang Market in Seoul, South Korea, and you may have seen this place in my earlier sketching video. And you may notice that I'm actually doing a voice over over the video clips that I have recorded. So this is unlike my usual vlogs where I talk about my trip in first person. These are my sketcher friends. That's Paul on the left and that's Michelle on the right side who is wearing the blue jacket. She's one of the organizers for the Gyeongju Sketch Festar and she invited me to be the instructor there. It's such a wonderful experience to be able to catch up with my sketching friends again, to chat with them, to sketch with them, many of whom I've actually met during the international sketching events such as the Urban Sketches Symposium and the Asia Link Sketch Walk. And speaking of the Asia Link Sketch Walk, the upcoming one is in Suwon in South Korea and it's going to happen on the 4th to 7th of October 2023. And the last time I checked, the tickets are still available. So if you happen to be available during that time, if you enjoy sketching, I highly recommend you go buy the tickets and go join this event because you will be able to make a lot of friends, you will have a lot of fun, and you will have memories that you will remember for the rest of your life. I spent about a week in South Korea, split between Seoul and Gyeongju, and unfortunately we fell sick, me and my wife fell sick halfway, so it wasn't a very pleasant experience. These are the sponsor booths at the Gyeongju Sketch Festar, and there are two rows packed with sponsors selling all sorts of art supplies. That's Charlie selling his watercolor palettes made with wood. And these are very beautiful watercolor palettes. I believe he sells them online as well. And I will provide you the link to where you can find these palettes in the video description below. There are many art products on sale, such as sketchbooks, Watercolor brushes. That's the guy selling Yo Yo watercolor brushes, which is a brand, if I'm not wrong, from South Korea because I've not heard of this brand before. These are some inks on sale, and there are some paintings for sale as well. The painting and sketches are part of the silent auction. So for those who are interested to buy the artworks, they can write their name on a piece of paper. And because we are in South Korea, everyone was speaking Korean. So for the international instructors such as me, we actually have a translator assigned to us to help us communicate with the local sketchers. And that really helps a lot because otherwise uh, it would be like chickens talking to ducks. The Gyeongju Sketch Festar is actually a two-day event packed with workshops. So I had to teach for two days on two afternoons and it was actually my first time teaching at a workshop, at a live workshop. Teaching at workshops in person versus teaching on YouTube is very different because when you are teaching in person, you can interact with students and you can exchange ideas with them and you can also get inspired by the students through the questions that they ask. This is the opening for the event and it's so great to see so many people travel to Gyeongju to take part in this event. So by the way, it's a city that is two hours away from Gyeongju by their bullet train. After the opening, we had our lunch which were prepared for us by the wonderful volunteers and helpers and these were packed lunch. And after lunch, we went straight into the workshops. There were obviously more Korean instructors than international instructors. And for us international instructors, we need translators. The Gyeongju Sketch Fest star is targeted at South Korean sketchers and painters. 
So if you don't know the Korean language, language barrier is going to be a problem. This is unlike the Asia Link sketchwalks or the Urban Sketches symposiums, which are targeted at the international audience. So there will always be many translators around for the public. And when you go to international sketching events, you can go with your friends and you can hang out with your friends and you can make new friends as well. I have made so many friends over the years, over so many countries from Europe, USA, Asia, and recently in New Zealand, Australia. So after the workshops, it was dinner and the event was organized in a way that the students will eat dinner with the instructors. And that was such a good idea because these students, they actually sign up for the workshops because they like the instructors and they want to learn from the instructors. And after the workshops, they also get to interact with the instructors. This was an incredible and really fun experience and I really have to thank Michelle Yong for inviting me to be an instructor at the Gyeongju Sketch Fest Star. I actually have a lot to say about this event but unfortunately I did not record enough video clips to talk more about the event so I'm gonna have to end this video here. Thanks for watching and don't miss the Asia Link Sketchwalk in Suwon, South Korea if you are available to go to that event. See you guys again. Bye.